Oh, well, buckle in. Get ready for fun and learning. This is a homeschool pop U.S. States video. In this video, we are learning about the state of Florida. <laughs> that sounds so wonderful. The state of Florida. The first thing we want to learn about Florida is where is Florida? If you're looking for Florida, where do you need to go? Where is Florida located? It's a good thing we have this United States map, right? Because without this map, we wouldn't be able to find Florida and you wouldn't learn where it is, you know? But now we're going to discover where Florida is. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, here it is. Here is where Florida is. It's in the bottom right hand corner of the United States. Florida is part of a region of the United States called the Southeast. The state of Florida is bordered by two states and two bodies of water. The state that's directly north of Florida is Georgia. Yeah. Then next to Georgia to the northwest of Florida is the state of Alabama. Now you might have noticed this, but the majority of Florida is actually bordered by water. To the east of Florida is the Atlantic Ocean. The Atlantic Ocean. All of the states that make up the east coastline of the United States border the Atlantic Ocean. On the other side of Florida, to the west of Florida, is the Gulf of Mexico. The Gulf of Mexico is an ocean basin of the Atlantic Ocean. To review, the state of Florida is right here in the bottom right hand corner of the east coast in a region of the United States called the Southeast. Let's look at some more facts, like this one. Does Florida have any nicknames? Are there any other names that the state of Florida goes by? Well, the state of Florida has two main nicknames. The first nickname is the Sunshine State. Yeah, that's a nice nickname. The second nickname is the Orange State. Let's talk about that first nickname, the Sunshine State. Why is Florida called the Sunshine State. Well, think about this. There are about 230 days of sunshine per year in Florida. The weather is just really beautiful. The sun is out so much of the time. That might be why Florida is so popular with tourists. That means people who come to visit the state. Now, there are a lot of cool places in Florida that bring people in, but the weather helps. The weather is just nice so much of the time. Okay, so that's why Florida is called the Sunshine State. But why is Florida called the Orange State? Well, they grow a lot of oranges in Florida. A lot of oranges a lot a ton a ton of oranges whenever you see oranges they probably came from Florida I mean there are other places where oranges can come from but Florida is the largest producer of oranges in the United States so Florida has two nicknames, the Sunshine State, the sun is out so much, the weather is beautiful, and the Orange State, a state that produces more oranges than any other state. Florida truly is the Orange State. All right, it's time to look at some more facts about the state of Florida. Hey. I bet those oranges are from Florida. Florida is the orange state. I bet those oranges are from Florida. All right, here is the flag of the state of Florida. 
This flag has a white background and a red St. Andrew's cross, which is a cross that is diagonal, almost like the shape of the letter X in Roman times. In the middle of the St. Andrew's cross is the great seal of the state of Florida. It features a Seminole woman spreading flowers, and there are two sable palms, which are the state trees of the state of Florida. And then there's a boat in the background, and you see the sunshine behind it. It's a beautiful picture with the state motto below it saying, In God We Trust. All right, now we're going to look at some places in Florida. Right up here in the northern part of the state is Tallahassee. Tallahassee is the capital of Florida. Then in the northeast part of the state is a city called Jacksonville. Jacksonville is the largest city in Florida. Then south of Jacksonville are three huge tourist cities, Orlando, Tampa, and way far south, the city of Miami. And this is awesome. Did you know 75 million people visit Florida each year? 75 million people! Okay, Orlando, Tampa, Miami, Tallahassee, Jacksonville. I mean, and Orlando brings them big time because, you know, they've got that place that sings about how small the world is and all that. Tampa, Miami, beautiful places, all the beaches, everything. Oh, Florida! Whew, talking about all those places almost makes me hungry. All right, here's our final question. What is the state bird of Florida? The state bird of Florida is the mockingbird, and that's a well-earned name because the mockingbird mocks or mimics the sounds of other birds, the sounds of insects and amphibians and other creatures. They're very loud with it, and sometimes, you know, they repeat it over and over and over and over and over again, so they're a little bit of an annoying bird for some people, but they're still really cool, you know, the mockingbird. You know, they, they mock, they mimic, they do what they want to do. The mockingbird is the state bird of Florida. Thanks for watching this homeschool pop video on the state of Florida, the orange state, the sunshine state. 